Hey, welcome to a Feature Friday. I want to show the print triggers, the printing system. Um, we use Cloud Print. So first, this is an optional feature. You can just look at PDFs and hit print like every other web app out there. But we've also gone a pretty big step further and made it so um, you can make printing happen completely automatically. So in the App Center, there is Google Cloud Print. Enable instant and automated printing. Um, once you've got this turned on, it'll show an email linked, and you can visit the printers section to sync your printers. The knowledge base is going to take you through a number of steps to make this work, but the gist of it is you go into Chrome settings, turn on cloud print, and then your printers on your computer will be linked through Chrome to Google's cloud, and then through Google, you can give Repair Shopper permission to your printers. And these can be your thermal receipt printers. You can see I've got a Dymo label writer, a star thermal printer that's hooked up to my receipt drawer. Um, and it automatically adds this save to Google Docs and any other printers your system has. Um, and then Repair Shopper has the ability to send the print job to the Google Cloud, and Google will send it to your printer. And then the print job happens totally automatically. So an example configuration is for like um, a receipt printer, you can come in here and say ticket receipts are on and I want to print one and automatically print from triggers is on and then receipts on quantity one and in this case I've got automatically print from triggers off. So what this means is this printer is supposed to handle receipts so we've got on and on. Ticket receipts are going to be automatic so that means when a ticket is created you don't have to click anything or think about it. A couple seconds later, the receipt just comes out of the receipt printer without you doing anything. So if you're coming from an, an offline POS, like a Windows desktop app, automatic printing is pretty common. But in the world of web POS software, or web invoicing software, this isn't really done, but it's super handy. To show you how easy it is to manually print a um, print job through this system, once you've got the cloud print enabled, there's this new print menu here. You can just say print, ticket receipt, boom, it's sent. And again, when this ticket is created, that happens automatically without you clicking anything. So no more PDF, looking at the PDF, waiting for the PDF to load, finding the print icon, selecting your printer. You can skip all that stuff by using cloud print. There is a delay. On average, it usually takes about five seconds for the print job to happen. But that little five second wait is far worth it to save you those however many six clicks and selecting the printer and all that. If you've got registers enabled, the printers can automatically be tied to a register. Um, we might have registers on this test account. Sure, front desk. Um, so now you can say front desk always has this printer and maybe your your back shop register will have a different printer. So then different registers can automatically be printing their invoice and payment receipts and stuff to the correct printer. Um, so that's in there. Back to this. So the, the way to set this up is to find your like receipt printer and turn on the receipt options and then go back to the printers page and find your like letter size printer, which we don't have here. And you could turn on invoices, tickets, intake forms um, for your letter printer. And then your Dymo label printer could print all the labels and tags. So um, customer labels, asset labels, ticket labels, and maybe you don't want all these automatic. Maybe these ones aren't automatic, but ticket are. Totally up to you. You can have them all off. Um, and then just use the print buttons in the app. But turning on the different printers makes it so like the ticket label one, when a ticket's created, it'll automatically spit out of your Dymo printer a little label that you can just attach to that job. Um, so, pretty handy. It'll print the right quantities of everything. You can have it print a full size, a receipt, and two labels. You can have it do whatever you want. Um, you should really play with that. I know a lot, we get a lot of feedback that, you know, sometimes it's slow. Um, you know, this is the only system out there like that that we get to use that supports a bunch of printers, is automatic in your browser. We're going to stick with it for now just because there isn't another solution, but I would say in general it works really well and you may have to fiddle with it now and then, um, but it's worth the fiddling 
with now and then to have fully automated printing. So if you're not using that, definitely check it out. See ya.